It helped make high altitude flight feasible and allowed us to venture deep beneath the surface of the ocean. It has saved the sight of countless infants and helps keep our food safe to eat. Originally developed for the military, Dr. Beckman's oxygen analyzer has advanced numerous industries, including aeronautics, energy, food, paper and textiles, biotech, healthcare, and many others. In 1940, the U.S. military urgently needed an instrument that could reliably measure oxygen levels in aircraft. They turned to Linus Pauling, who proposed a solution. He turned to Arnold Beckman to make it happen. Dr. Pauling's original prototype was not a particularly complicated device, but was difficult to produce due to the tiny, fragile glass dumbbell it required. Just three millimeters long, the dumbbell was suspended on virtually invisible quartz fiber. When a sample was drawn into the analysis cell, the magnetic force caused the dumbbell to rotate. A light beam projected on a small mirror attached to the dumbbell reflected the angle of the beam onto a transparent scale, indicating the oxygen content of the sample. Knowing how vital it was to produce these meters, Dr. Beckman quickly devised ways around the manufacturing problems and was soon producing them for the military. The oxygen analyzer took off in fighter jets, only to land in neonatal wards, where premature infants were fighting a very different battle. By the 1950s, doctors and scientists knew that too much oxygen in incubators could cause blindness. The Beckman Model D2 oxygen meter was the only product available for the routine monitoring of oxygen concentrations. It soon became indispensable in hospital nurseries around the world. In 1955, Dr. Beckman was again recruited by the military to create an analyzer that could monitor the atmosphere in atomic submarines. Servicemen would be spending weeks or even months submerged, and maintaining healthy air quality was critical. Equipped with a Beckman atmosphere analyzer, the Sea Wolf set an underwater record in 1958, staying submerged for 60 days and revolutionizing our naval capabilities. The ability to precisely monitor oxygen levels and air quality has revolutionized many industries and helped keep tens of thousands of servicemen and women, along with countless civilians, safe.